Team killing players and escape from Tarkov apparently provoke anger among the vast majority of the EFT community to such an extent that players disrespect anyone who plays the game in an unconventional way. I mean, extract camp is like um, it's what it's, it's, it's whenever nobody ever gives you any attention and any girl you chase end up end up uh, stonewalling you because you're a pussy. You look like shit, you smell like shit, you're going away in life. You have no goals. Your parents are talking in ten years. That's what you do. You. Exit and just because we, team killers and extra campers, make matters easier for us to fill our stashes with loot by employing less challenging tactics, are considered the bad apples of Tarkov. And I'm not gonna lie that this problem concerns me as well, and for that reason, in order to prove that this malevolence towards EFT team killers and campers is completely illegitimate, I'm going to have a closer look at their arguments in my comment section, so... <sighs> Let's cut to the chase for goodness sake. Shabo Valentin 5179 says, Bro, the first video was with me. You're a p bro. Well, touch across, you f***ing insult. This is so f***ing cringe. There is no way you actually ask. If I have no skill, how do I kill you so easily? Because they had their backs turned to you. You f***ing art. It sucks mommy and daddy don't love you. But then go to therapy. Tarkov is not helping your inferiority complex. People like you who enjoy the anger of others just add no value to society. You're an absolute Loser. This is embarrassing. Get alive. This is quite possibly the worst content I have ever seen regarding Tarkov. You guys are absolute ass and should have gotten bit by your parents. Mom! I Latinico says, You're a sad person, but it looks like you have your fair shared other human beings to hang out with. DW. The hell does that mean though? One day, you will grow up and learn. This is honestly so f***ing cringe. Contract killers? Like seriously, that's not even a part of the game. You guys are just losers. That's you know, little d to people being justifiably upset at you, being an asshole after pretending to be their friend. There is nothing cool or horrible about your playing style. It's just screams, I'm a huge f***ing girl, get killed on me, so I have to literally deceive people. Get alive, this is pathetic. Stop coping. Have you ever considered you're actually the one coping with the fact that you suck at playing the game normally, and that's why you do this uh, stupid shit to get back at everyone who's better than you? Makes total sense. I would also not be surprised if you cheat since that's obviously the type of scumbag you are. Cop harder, bro. You are and will always be the target of vectors. You can respond to this with your what seems to be typical gay passive aggressive attitude, but from everything I've seen, you're a shitty friend. It's a game, so I doubt they take it seriously because, let's be honest, none of you all are making money off this content, but to slaughter your friends in a basement and spam cop from a soundboard as they get pressed like any normal person will scream some sort of mental issue. Not gonna you might be autistic. Another dog video from the one and only biggest of Tarkov, Vectors. You will never get big. Your YouTube will die out and rot, and you have made so many people hate you and your content. Feels good, right? Well, yes. In your delusionary mind, it probably does. It is no the way of helping people the game lucrative? Yes, of course, but only for sh people who have no sense of shame or guilt. Wouldn't be surprised if you acted similarly in real life. Get a job, get a life, get a girlfriend. All the sh you definitely don't have, because anyone who did would have more self-respect to create such garbage content like this. This is what happens when someone with no friends or actual skills wants kills. LOL. How desperate for attention can you be? Crying emoji. You're shaking after killing your teammates, LMFAO, there's something mentally wrong with you. Stop coping. LMFAO, you're sad and you're broke. All you say to people back in you is stop coping, you're shaking your pants after killing your teammates. Poland, ha 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 What does Poland have to do with my TK? What a loser, we can see that you're shaking when you kill them because you are a p Will get zero kills. I don't get what's fun in this. You should play video games to have fun, to be a fat nerd who enjoys running people day. That's why nobody loves you, not even your parents. My problem with you is not about the game, it's about your f***ing principles and you got none, dog. You're a Bro. piece of shit that lives under a f***ing gutter. Bro. And in listen, my country, no, dog, in my country, Bro. listen, listen, Bro. in my country, we got first world problems, dog. We got first world problems. My problem is how the f*** my lawn is gonna get mowed, dog. Your problem is feeding your f***ing family, dude. Go feed your f***ing family, you piece of shit. I make 200k a year to deal with f***ing <laughs> 
know, bro. I work in cybersecurity. I would f you up, bro. <laughs> fuck, I mean, f up, bro. You dumb as <laughs> bro. Nah, you got no work principles, work bro. Work You're work not a man, bro. You is not no man. You is a boy, ugly ass You ugly ass you're a nerd, bro. I'm just a here to play, bro. You're a fucking nerd, dog. You're a principalist nerd, bro. You got no morals. You got no principles. Your mom is probably fucking like, bro. She probably was like, God damn, I can't believe I gave birth to this, bro. 